plaintiff, Marquia Richardson, dated the defendant, and she claims while she was pregnant with his child, the defendant cheated on her with his witness. Marquia is suing her ex for unpaid rent, a security deposit, and damaged property. Defendant Marlon Thompson admits that he was intimate with Marquia, but insists they never dated. Marlon is countersuing for car damages and emotional distress. Start with you. I'd like to start by letting you know that uh, Mr. Thompson is the epitome of psycho. He crazy. <laughs> um, when did you meet him or start um, it's dating? About two years ago. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then how did it go? What made you think he well, was crazy uh, or psycho? What was he doing? Well, of course, in, in any relationship, it started off pretty good. We both was in a long-term relationship, 10 plus years. We was having issues. So um, we got together, you know, went out, had fun. You know, we kind of use that as, you know, get away from stress of home type mm -hmm. thing. Um, so it, a little shortly after that, we ended up staying together. Um, I ended up pregnant and things kind of went south from there. Um, I found out, you know, while- From I was, pregnancy or from after the, you from had From pregnancy, the from pregnancy. Um, found out what? I found out that he was messing with this tramp over here. Stop, um, that's not my, right, ma'am. Don't do that no more. Oh. I'm sorry. Thank you. Go ahead. But yeah, so I found out he was messing with her um, during my pregnancy through text messages and stuff that I was finding through his phone. He obviously lied. I, I, I contacted her. She, oh, that's my friend. That's my friend. Um, he was like, oh, she's just giving me rides and stuff back to work. Yeah, she, she was giving him rides, all right. Leave that woman alone. You're mad because she took your man. Uh, well, she now leave never, her alone. Never been her man. <laughs> okay. Well, um, like I said, Bobby and Whitney can have each other. They probably high now. <laughs> they probably over there high yeah, now. Sure but anyway, I'm sorry, that is funny. <laughs> anyway, she got you. I was like I said, up for you, but that was I, I can probably guarantee you they high right now. So anyway, what's the psycho part? Tell me about he's, him. He's He's psycho, Your Honor. Tell me what he has done in those two years. He's verbally, yeah. physically, abusively. There you go. Um, get he's to the, abusive. Get to that. Physically, Give mentally, me and How many times? How often, rather? Every day, argue every day, and he's verbally he's verbally abusive in front of my kids and everything. Um, Your Honor, this man is is. And you went for that for it's, two it's years. Crazy. Now I don't believe for you two years. For yes, Your Honor. 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 Yes, arguing and he pushing me around and doing stuff like that. How often Honor. did he do that, ma'am? He's only done that physically about three times okay. since I've been with him. All right. But yes, Your Honor. So anyways, like th like I said, throughout my pregnancy, you know, I was taking off of work. Your Honor, he, he stayed with me from January all the way to September. I was taking off of work early due to having preterm labor. Um, this man was working. I wasn't working. He said, help me with rent not one time. It's constantly, well, we get into it. Like I said, we get into it every day. So I'm getting ready to leave anyway. I'm going to leave everywhere. I'm supposed to leave anyway. He's been saying that since January. Yeah, every month leave. when rent time is there, he yes, starts an argument leave. and says, well, I'm <laughs> going anyway. Yes, he's getting ready to leave. Uh -huh. Then he comes and back I've after you paid it. Your Honor, I've called the police and tried to have him put out after during arguments. Okay. They would not make him leave, telling me I had to legally evict him. And they told um, you, right, let me hear from you, sir. Okay, a little background. I met Marquia a year and 10 months ago at a bar. We were, I, I knew her before that but never really had a conversation with her. My significant other of 13 years worked at the bar. She wasn't that significant. Go no, ahead. not her. <laughs> not well, her. I know, the one you're talking hey, about, you hey. run off. But no, I didn't run off. Eat her up too. So well, she, she ran off. That, you, gotta, you don't have her no more. I don't know what happened, but you don't have her no, no more. No. So she couldn't been that significant to you. No, we were going, we were having issues. I mean, I caused problems. We had relationship well, problems. Well, we didn't say that. And then I you talk, ran her off. Yeah, it's like you run her off. No, I've been trying to give her yeah. away. Tell me about yes. that. Well, why you ain't left then? You're trying to give me away, hey. but you ain't left. Hey, I'm trying to give away, but like I said, Yana, I met her a year and 10 months ago. Uh, let him talk, man. A yes. year and 10 months ago, and uh, we never had an agreement for me to pay any rent. And That's I did. not what we're talking about yet. Tell me about the relationship. She has there was none. made you look bad. There you was never, no relationship, you, Yana, from okay. day one. I so talked you to all her. never dated? No. You were never intimate? Yes. <laughs> Okay. That don't mean and we have a relationship. And you moved in with her? Uh, eventually. Why? Because I was having some hard times from where I was staying at. Defendant Marlon Thompson has a child with the plaintiff, and she claims while she was pregnant, 
Marlon cheated on her with his witness. How long did you stay with her? I moved in the house before she did in when January. Was that? In January. Oh, so it was your house. <laughs> well, she couldn't get her lights on because she owed bills. And I did call her and ask, like, because I just... Was she living there already? No. Okay, so whose name Your was Honor, it in? It's in it was in name. it was in her well, name. Well, that was her place, sir. What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, I understand. It was her place. You move in there. Oh, why would you move in somewhere that doesn't have lights anyway? You were really broke. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> always. Uh, why did you move in with the woman? Broke. Why did you take care of yourself? Or because because we were friends. And so I, what? And you didn't have offered... any male friends? Yeah, I don't even what? No male friends. No. Nobody would let you move in with them other than her. Uh, it was she called and asked me to move in with her. Why? Because she wanted to be with me. And you think she just wanted you to move in with her to just see you running around the house? Or something? Uh, no, I did a lot more, Yana. Like I said, I no, put... No, what was the purpose of you moving in? To get to myself. To come and help out? To help me out. Okay. What are you doing got, like that for? You I, act like it's all right to live off this no, woman no. and not pay any money and play like you didn't know you wasn't dating her, yet you say you were yeah. intimate. You're uh, coming across as you. a scrub. Thank you. I want you to know thank that. You. And, and, You're and coming I, and I across understand. all those thank months. You. How often did you work? How I've often did you the work? The whole time. The entire time? The entire time. All right, how much did you give her a month then, or a week? Uh, there was no agreement. I, I, I didn't paid, ask you about an agreement. I, I said, how her, much did you give? You moved uh, into a woman's in a house. Month. Okay. And don't make an agreement on how much you're going to give her a right. month. Right. And here I you didn't. claim to have been working. And yes. just because there wasn't an agreement, that's your response. That means right. you gave her nothing. Thank no, you. Show I, me I, evidence that you did. Thank what you. What did you give her? Show me some evidence. Okay, the evidence. Take your time. Take okay. all the time you need. No problem, sir. All right. Go oh, ahead. Okay. How yes, much did he give, Your man? Honor, he never gave me I know anything. he doesn't. He's he coming across as anything. a scrub. <laughs> I've seen him a thousand times and, and this living off women. Yes. What is that you had? A bill. Yes. What is that? A bill. A light bill. That said you paid it? Yeah. No. And no, it says that it's what? old. Dude. It's old. It's, it's, <laughs> yeah, because you haven't paid it. Thank you, Your Honor. <laughs> Yeah, Thank you. You're the worst. Yes. You're the worst. Yes, Tell horrible. me about the rent, it's man. Been you're suing okay. him for. So this isn't the first house that he lived it with me at. <laughs> he had followed me all the way to Texas, but he didn't want to be with me. I moved to Texas. He came to Texas. Is that true? No. Yes, all right. You never lived in Texas. Yes, I did. Yes. With her? Yes. Yes, we stayed together. You just yes. said it wasn't I true. Thank man, you, get out of here. Judgment for the plaintiff. Your claim is dismissed. You purchased yourself. Oh my God. Mr. Man. Hey. Hey. Girl, that's your problem, not boo boo. That's your problem, Mr. Man. Hey, hey. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, nothing. I ain't got nothing to say to him. I'm happy. She's horrible. I'm getting the money that he should have been paid a long time She's ago. She's miserable. Um, take care of your baby. Do something for your baby. You're miserable. I bought <laughs> You're everything miserable. for your You're baby. Mad. You ain't he have paid a diaper. Two hundred dollars. You ain't have a diaper. From a booster. He bought some stolen items for her. What you buy? I brought everything else. 